All right, so here are some of my co-host confessionals. Here, Cheddar. One of my earliest relationship memories with Chris is when we bought a PS3. This was such a random event. We were just hanging out at home one day and it was very early on in our relationship and it was very expensive. It was like 600 or even 700 bucks and we just randomly went to a Walmart and dropped the money for a PS3 and uh, Heavenly Sword was the game that we bought with it to play. And I just remember thinking how totally random that was for us to do in such an early part of our relationship, which really set the stage for how much more random will come in the rest of our lives. We frequently talk about this random walk that we took in the park that changed the course of our lives because we decided to go back to school. We talk about this random walk in the park again where we saw some people kayaking. We decided to buy kayaks on a whim and that sort of set the outdoor part of our lives, which leads us to the random act of us deciding to stream one day. And it was just sort of us hanging out, getting to play some games and using some technology involved to see if anyone was interested in watching us play. And here's a little bit of a confession. Early on in those very first streams that we were in our Airstream recording, we were pretending things were going on and pretending that we were places that we weren't just to make the stream more interesting. But we were in the front yard of the house in the driveway and there were no bears, there were no people knocking on our Airstream. Getting to stream with Chris three times a week is such an amazing experience. We've always said from the beginning that if we're not having fun, then what are we doing? So getting to share part of that with uh, everyone on stream every Monday or every Tuesday, Thursday. What am I saying? I don't stream on those days. Getting to share a small part of our relationship with the community has been truly, truly amazing. And I'm so proud of me and Chris for doing what we've done. We've put a lot of work into it. We've learned a lot of skills. Can you believe Chris is now coding a game and has made a game from scratch? Absolutely blows my mind. His patchwork that he's, de that he's done absolutely has blown my mind. And it's just phenomenal to me as lifelong learners that we're continuously learning from something like this, from something like streaming. I'm also really proud of the community that we've built. 500 episodes later, we have the absolute most fantastic community on the planet. Cheddar just opened the door. One of my favorite parts of being with Chris, which in turn means streaming, is how absolutely goofy and silly we let ourselves be. And this is something I didn't think of myself. I didn't think that I was this way or I didn't think that I could be this way. And Chris has helped me unlock this part of myself by just making silly jokes or acting in a silly way. And I've learned so much about just to have more fun and not worry about things and not take things as seriously. And uh, I'm super lucky to have that in my life. So 500 episodes later, can you believe that? It truly just feels like it's the beginning and I can't wait for what else me and Chris have in store for the stream, for the community, and for each other. Here's to 500 more.